Hello, my name is Alban O'Melli and I'm uh, delighted to welcome you today to the Cardiovascular Research on Life interview today with Professor Kanyas. So Professor Kanyas is uh, an, a professor and a distinguished uh, researcher professor at the University of Cincinnati. Welcome Professor Kanyas. Thank you. And thank you so much for agreeing to uh, share your thought with us today. Uh, so we're going to start with the first question. Uh, you recently won the basic uh, research prize uh, of the American Heart Association. Uh, what uh, does it mean to you? This is a huge honor for me and a reward of all our work through many decades to understand the role of calcium dynamics in heart function and especially in heart failure and arrhythmias and to identify potential therapeutic targets for these diseases. So then, what would you consider to be the, the key milestone discovery uh, in your career? Yes, um, it is the role of phospholamban that we uncovered in the heart, especially under basal or flight and fight conditions, which paved the way towards therapeutic approaches to target phospholamban or its partners as potential therapy in heart failure as well as arrhythmias. We also found several phospholamban mutations in patients with heart failure and arrhythmia and now there is a phospholamban foundation organized by the patients and we're working closely with them to develop potential therapy for them. So uh, then uh, what is left to be achieved uh, in the field of cardiovascular uh -huh. research to prevent fatal arrhythmias and treat heart failure? Yes. Um, basically, how do you see the future in this field? So I think we need to develop a deeper and better understanding of the molecular and cellular mechanisms underlying these diseases especially at early stages, to try to prevent the development, the further development of deterioration. This, coupled with the exponential growth of the new technologies, will enable scientists to ask deeper, detailed questions and get more integrative answers so they can move towards therapy faster and more effectively. These are my thoughts. Mm -hmm. Thank you. So finally, uh, what advice would you give to the young scientists um, community willing or hoping to get involved into the basic uh, cardiovascular research? Um, we are now at a very exciting crossroad of basic and clinical cardiovascular research. Things are moving very fast mm -hmm. and at a very high rate for the young scientists. My biggest advice to the young people is if you love what you're doing, continue doing it and you will be successful. Mm -hmm. On the way, you need to remain focused, you need to remain innovative, keep your goals in mind, be compassionate about your work and also resilient. It may take lots of hard work to achieve your goals, but nothing comes without a price. And always remember that science is a playful and highly rewarding activity. The stars should be the only limit for our young scientists. Professor Kanyas, thank you so much. And uh, thank you to our viewers. Thank you very much for having me.